Does Grimaldi's Pizzeria in El Segundo measure up to the hype of its famous counterpart in Brooklyn? We'll find out on this episode of Two Slice Challenge. My name is Steve, and I'm on a mission to find the best New York-style pizza outside of New York. So I'm testing out all of the pizzerias claiming to make an authentic New York-style slice by giving them the Two Slice Challenge. That's a slice of cheese and a slice of pepperoni. If they nail these, it's a good bet the rest of their pizza will also be good. Those pizzerias that pass the test will be featured on my blog, The Land of Za. Grimaldi's Under the Brooklyn Bridge is widely considered to be one of the best pizzerias in New York. Being one of the founding fathers of New York pizza, their coal-fired pizza ovens have produced some amazing pizzas over the years for those lucky visitors who have the patience and hunger to wait online for an hour or so. But since I lived over an hour away from Brooklyn, in a place with plenty of great pizza places nearby to choose from, I had never been to Grimaldi's. So I was delighted to discover that Grimaldi's had a location here in Los Angeles. Finally, I would get to try it. The place is located on Rosecrans in El Segundo at the base of an industrial building. They have some patio seating outside in front and a large dining room inside. It's very upscale and has a franchise vibe. There's even a full bar. But the red and white checkered tablecloths and aroma of pizza in the air told me I was in a pizzeria. The waitress was quick to point out that this Grimaldi's was connected to the original in Brooklyn and prides themselves with upholding the same level of quality. So now my expectations were off the charts. Since they only serve full pies, we ordered a large pizza, half cheese, half pepperoni which arrived at our table looking very much like the Grimaldi's pizza I had seen online in my research. The cheese slice was very good. The crust was cooked nicely and had a good flavor, but could be crispier for my taste. The sauce was pretty basic and not too spicy, and the cheese was tasty as well. But due to the way they make their pizza, I would sometimes get a bite with only sauce or one with just cheese. I would have preferred it to have a blend of cheese and sauce in every bite. The pepperoni slice, on the other hand, was awesome, really flavorful and delicious. Somehow, by adding pepperoni to the slice made it taste much more in balance. Plus, they are using some pretty good quality pepperoni. Overall, I enjoy Grimaldi's Pizzeria and would definitely come back again. Considering how delicious that pepperoni slice was, I'll just bet their other topping combos will be awesome. But I must admit, I was hoping for more with their cheese slice. It didn't quite hit it for me. While it was very good, based on all the hype surrounding Grimaldi's, I expected to be blown away. Perhaps I set my expectations too high. Either way, I know now that the next time I'm back in New York, I must make the pilgrimage out to the original Grimaldi's in Brooklyn, so I can see how this location truly measures up. Until then, I'm glad to know there is a Grimaldi's nearby trying to bring great coal oven baked New York pizza here to the West Coast.